Boy, it happened. It's the boy, guys. I'm back again with another video. Today, we are reacting to another Diamond video. Rich Mom Shames Poor Mom's Gift. What happens next is shocking. Let's get into it, guys. Can I help you find something? Yes. I would like this in a size 10. Um, unfortunately, all the sizes we have are already on the floor. Rhonda always keeps a special supply for me in the back. Don't you know who I am? Why is she talking so evil? And who cares about who she is? She probably, a, like, you're, you a nobody to her. You know what I'm saying? Um, no. I am Avery Preston. Probably this store's biggest spender. Oh, I'm so sorry, Miss Preston. This is my first day, but I... I don't care if you spend so much money at this store. Like, okay? certainly heard your name we'll go find my jacket before it's your last day here right away did you want me to start a room for you i don't try things on if they don't how is she supposed to know that <laughs> oh my god fit i throw them away <laughs> nina i didn't know you shopped here Avery, hi. Um, actually, I really don't. I just, I was just returning something. Are those the shoes I got you for your birthday? Um. That's embarrassing. She's returning the shoes that she got her for her birthday. She probably doing it because she need money. <gasps> okay. Yes, they are. I'm sorry. I'm returning them. I just. I love them. It's not that I don't. It's just I couldn't justify having thousand dollar pairs of shoes. I don't even have that much in my bank account. You have got to be kidding me. You are returning my gift for cash? It's fine. She's struggling. She ain't got money like you. Tacky, but fine. Hurry up. I don't have all day. Get me my jacket. That is embarrassing, though. Like, I could tell she's embarrassed for returning them. No, Chester, I need to know how this happened. But you know what, I, what I'm what i thinking, y'all? Like, if you so rich, why can't you help your friend out with some money then? But you're going to give her a $1,000 pair of shoes. <laughs> I don't care how long it takes. We need to get this thing fixed. Apparently, some of uh, our documents weren't filed properly, so we may not be going public in two weeks like planned. So what does that mean? It means that the big liquidity event that I've been talking about may not happen. Ben, you said we had a big payday coming. I know what I said, Avery, but things may have changed. Look, I, I don't know yet. Look, either way, we need to cut down on spending for a little bit. Look, just... Right, why are you over here trying to buy Louis Vuitton, Gucci, and Chanel and all that? So we're in the clear. I have spent my whole life pinching pennies. I am not going back there. I'm so sorry, miss. Oh, and she cut her hand. Olivia, are you okay? You're bleeding. Do you have any idea how much those bowls cost? She don't care about her 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 employee being hurt. She she care about how much the whatever costs. Like, come on now, really, dude. Have some sympathy here now. More than your entire paycheck. It, it was an accident. I I lost. Her my husband is, has a better attitude than she does. My crib, and I promise I'll pay you back somehow. With what money? You can't even afford a piece of that bowl. Trust me. Look, we have plenty of dishes, okay? The most important thing is, is that you're going to be okay. All right? I'm going to go get a Band-Aid. He's mad at his wife. Like, girl, like, <laughs> out of the whole situation, you worried about a bowl. <laughs> you better not get blood all over everything as you clean up your mess.
Nina? Is everything okay? It's my transmission. I think it's done. There goes that thousand. Why don't you just replace the whole thing? Cause she ain't got money, dude. Like she not rich, dude. Like you, apparently. But you over here trying to make sure she okay, but you won't. And you buy buy her a thousand dollar pair of shoes, but you won't give her no money to help her out financially with her her issues. Man, I don't know how you're driving around in this car. <laughs> it's not by choice. You know, not everyone is as fortunate as you. Right. Avery. Oh, I love your purse. It's so chic. I'm so glad I ran into you. Abby's having a birthday party at the end of the month. Bring the girls. It's going to be so much fun. Oh, Destiny and I would love to come. What does Abby want for her birthday? Oh, anything's fine. Lately, though, she has been into the Kylie Cosmetics and the MAC makeup, even though I tell her... Kylie Cosmetics stuff. Pretty sure that's expensive. Oh, you're too young to wear makeup. <laughs> but really, don't spend a lot. Okay, well, it's no problem. I will get her both. Oh, and makeup is one of those great things that you can't return. You know, because some people like to return birthday gifts. Wow, she really holding a grudge. What? Oh. Well, there's Abby. I gotta get going. I'll see you later. I did not appreciate that. You know that I'm struggling. Your little comments, they aren't helpful. I don't know what you mean. What happened to you? Ever since you got all this money, you changed. So, I would think that they've been friends before she had money. And then now she got money, she got a big head, a, a really big head. Yeah, I've changed. It's called growth. You know, that's not what I mean. Avery, we grew up in the same neighborhood. You know what it's like to have nothing. Why are you looking down on me? Look, I am not right. going to apologize for making it out just because you didn't. And I would appreciate if you don't bring that up. <laughs> but you call yourself a friend and still trying to be her friend. People, that is a chapter of my life I've tried hard to forget. What? Hi, sweetheart. Hi, Mom. Oh, my gosh. we got to go. I've got that nail appointment. Why do you have grease in your hair, sweetie? Oh, don't you worry. Go ahead and sit in the car. I'm going to call somebody to help us. And that's supposed to be her so-called friend. See her have trouble with her car and still love her there. Why are we stopped here? I'm sorry, Mrs. Preston. The road's blocked. I can't turn. Well, find your way around it. If I am late for my nail appointment, Sally will cancel me. Yes, Cannot go another day without a pedicure. What did you do that? He almost hit that lady. And what's she talking about? What do you do that do that for? What you see the lady in front of the car? What that for? I'm sorry, Mrs. Preston. This woman just jumped in front of the car. I Miss Preston. Excuse me, do you have a death wish? Oh, I'm so sorry. I just really needed this bottle. That's all. I think you jumped out in front of the car on purpose. Wanting a payout, I'm sure. Look, I have a job, but I collect bottles for some extra... Cash. Wait. Avery. McMahon. It's Brenda Long from Apartment 2C. We used to live right across the hall from each other before... Wow, so she acting like she, she don't want to remember her. Before Ben's company started. <laughs> uh, you must have me confused with somebody else. Just watch where you're going next time. You're lucky we didn't hit you. Wow. I'd heard that you had changed a lot since your boyfriend's business. Yeah, she has changed a lot. Her attitude. Business took off. Husband. Right. Well, my mom used to say, be nice to everyone on the way up. Because you just might have to pass him again one day. Yeah. On way down. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry, y'all. Look, I'm getting serious now, because that's so true. <laughs> Good one. Who was that, Mom? A nobody. Isaac, let's get out of this neighborhood. I don't want to be here another moment. Yes, ma'am. Hello, darling. 
But what happened now? Finan financial problems, they going down. Hello, Earth to Ben. It's over, Avery. What? What are you talking about? The S1 docs didn't get properly filed. Now the IPOs. Hey, wait, tramp. can you tell me in normal people talk? I have no clue what you're saying. We have no money, okay? The company hasn't been profitable in years, and we've been <sighs> living off of our investors' funding, and now that's all dried up, I was counting on that public offering. Man, God, man, we're broke. We're broke. As in for a couple of weeks, or? I don't know. It could be a couple of weeks. Look, and she just seemed like a gold digger, man. Like, she just like, is it a couple of weeks? Because if, if so, uh, we got I got to divorce you. Like, <laughs> could be a couple of years. It could be forever. We need to cut out all the expenses immediately. Oh, man, I just let Olivia go. Now I gotta go talk to Isaac. <sighs> We're gonna have to move out of here. Dang. They gotta let Olivia, uh, Isaac go too? And they gotta move out of that place. <laughs> and... And? What? What else? You may need to have to get a job. I can't yeah. believe this. I have spent most of my life worrying about money. And when we got married, you promised me I would never have to do well, that. Well, things happen. Maybe if you were much nicer to people, maybe this wouldn't have happened to you. You know what I'm saying? Again, do you have any idea how humiliating this is going to be for me? Me, Avery Preston, having to get a job. D girl, you not nobody. Like, as far as I know, you're with a husband that got successful but what have you done you know what i'm saying you just spent all his money what are the other moms at school going to say huh and where are we even gonna move to i talked to our old apartment they said that there's a unit available the least she could do is be there. what do you want me to do we failed you failed you failed Wow. Avery. Look at her, she mad and they gotta give up the car. <laughs> bro, she really mad, bro. <laughs> She got a whole attitude at him still. Look at her. And they had to balance. Look at her face. What, she's upset because she broke her precious plate. <laughs> Avery. Hi, Brenda. I was just visiting my, um... I ran into Ben this morning. He told me you guys moved back. Yeah. Go ahead. Rub it in. I'm sure this makes you feel really good. No, not at all. I'm just sorry about whatever happened. Oh. But she, see, you see, what she said to you was right. You all got to be kind to of people. I'm off. And I'm you're down. Job. <laughs> Does it really make a difference? I mean, collecting cans, could you not pay your bills without it? Oh, no, I 
can pay my bills and stuff like that. I do this so that I can save up. My son, he lives in New York with my mom. I couldn't afford to take care of him, so she offered to help. So it's, uh, it's been three years since I've held him, and uh, uh -huh. I do this so that I can buy plane tickets to go see him. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. See, and that's why you never judge people, because you don't know what they're going through. I get so emotional. Um, I'll see you later. Brenda, wait. Here you go. Thank you. This is Kristen. Sorry for your wait. Do you want me to get you a VIP room or a glass of champagne? No, I don't need any of that. Um, I came here because of these items. I'm sorry, I can't quite hear you? I said I want to return these items. Oh. Was there anything wrong? He's I... embarrassed to return items. No, you're not one to return something. No, I just... I need the money. Can we make it quick, please? Yeah, right away. Thank you, Preston. Oh, she laughing. <laughs> she laughing. Is there something funny? It's just embarrassing. You're just one of those people. You probably buy designer clothes. Just Look, she she met her match. Mm-hmm. She met her match. Look rich and then return them. <laughs> Excuse me? Do you know who I am? I am Avery Preston, this store's biggest spender. Looks like this store's biggest returner to me. <laughs> so tacky. <laughs> she met her match. Dude, that, that girl's rich and financially stable, and now she acted just like how she acted. <laughs> all right, we're all set. Did you want store credit? Could I get cash, please? Hey. Avery, are you okay? Um, yeah. I will be. What's up? Well, whatever's wrong, I got some news that's gonna change all of that. The company is going public. Do you know what that means? We're rich again. We're rich, baby. Are you sure? Why didn't you tell me sooner? Well, I didn't want to jinx it until it was done, and I just got the confirmation about an hour ago. I already broken the lease on our apartment, and I found a spectacular six-bedroom in the hills for us. That's... Yeah, she, better, she better not treat people like crap again. Come on now. She just saw how that lady treated her. She could, I know she could feel that, you know? That's wonderful. I'm sorry. I'm still in shock. Well, look, I know you're still at the store. Why don't you just buy yourself something nice? Shoot, why don't you just buy the whole store, okay? Things are gonna go back the way that they were. This is fantastic. I love you so much, baby, okay? And I'll talk to you later. If I was him, I'd be like, we need to have a talk about your attitude first. <laughs> All right, here you are. Is there anything else I can help you with? Oh, she gonna help her. Look, she gonna help her. Hi. Moving out so soon? Yeah, um, Ben's company went public after all. So we don't have to stay in this place anymore, thank God. Well, I'm happy for you. At least one of us made it out of this mess, and you did it twice. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make it sound I <laughs> understand. Take good care of yourself, girl. Thanks. Bye, bye. And after all that, that lady is still so sweet to her.
if I join you? Avery. Yeah. <laughs> Go for it. Thanks. So how have you been? About the same. But no complaints. I heard uh, Ben's company went public. Congratulations. Thanks. I... <laughs> I got you a little something. Oh, the gift table for Abby is on the inside. This isn't for Abby. Please, open it. Hey, well, you didn't have to do that. What? Was it those shoes that she returned, or did she get her a different pair? Well, I felt bad that you had to return them, and um, I felt even worse about what I said. Well, thanks. I mean, I really appreciate it, but I still can't take these. <laughs> it still feel wrong, especially when I just spent my whole savings fixing my car. Oh, but, but you don't even know what's inside. It's not the shoes. I don't understand I feel terrible about how I treated you and you were right I had changed but I spent the last couple of months walking down memory lane and now I remember where I came from thank you thank you so much you have no idea how much this is gonna help. Oh my gosh, yes! Oh. Kylie's cosmetics! Oh. Nina! <laughs> Nina! Open your gifts yet? I'm guessing that one is from you. Wow! Well. <laughs> she is not gonna be that happy when she sees what I got. Hey! At least you got her something. And you're doing the best you can. And that is all that matters. Now she talking like she got sense. Oh, she got her plane ticket to go see her son. That's so sweet. I'm, I'm crying, y'all. I'm crying. Hold up. That's so sweet. Is it a moment of truth? We adopt Ron from the Royal. Dang, that's sweet, y'all. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back for more videos, and I'm out.